Oh boy, this young couple, I believe, let me turn the camera just a little bit, I believe this is uh, Justin and Izzy, I'm pretty sure it's Justin, it could be Austin, but I got to find out if they need some help, I met them one week ago today, Father's Day, and they were uh, one week at that point, so now they're two weeks, almost three weeks, homeless. They look to be in their, you know, mid to late twenties. But uh, all right, let's go talk to them and find out what's going on. All right, guys. Let me adjust my strap here. They must be a hundred feet from the main road here. Occupying some shade. I can make this happen. Izzy. Hi. How are you today? Good. Was it was it Justin or Austin? Justin. That's what I thought. That's what I thought. You guys need some water, man? Yeah. yeah. Oh, Thank I see you. you got that battery. How's that working out for you? Good so far. Yeah. A yeah. uh, little uh, piece of advice. I would say you might want to, yeah, make sure you get some sunlight on that to keep it charging. Yeah. But uh, how you guys been? It's been a week now since I last saw you. It was Father's Day. Yeah. Yeah. You been all right? Everything cool? All right. <laughs> Not cool, but. <laughs> He's passing out. Really? Yeah. Why? Overheating. Overheating. Really? Do you get any electrolytes? I mean, like, you know, sodium, potassium, calcium, that type of thing? Really? No. No? This is our first time eating in almost a week now. What? We don't really uh, well, I'm going to help you solve that problem. Yeah. Let me get you, I got some lunches. Um, they're similar to last time, but, you know, there's uh, no peanut butter and jelly. You guys weren't big fans of it in the first place. But, uh. Got the Vienna sausages. This is some uh, beef bologna and cheese, you know, with a pudding, a chocolate drink, yeah. you know, some snacks. All right, give me a couple minutes. I'll be right back. Okay. Anything else you might need? Everything going all right? Yeah, so far. Have the police been giving you any trouble? The police? Yeah. No. All right. Well, cross your fingers. Nah. <laughs> nah. nah. I hope so. All right. I'll be right back, guys. Okay, thank you. All right. No problem. Man, <laughs> they're about as flagrant as it gets. I mean, they're 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 just camped out right in the lawn, you know, right in entrance to Walmart. Tell the truth, it really doesn't get much more obvious. They will be uh, they will be talked to. There's no doubt about that. But they're fresh, man. Got some good stuff. Teresa sent a bunch of good snacks, protein bars, I mean uh, granola bars, uh, bre breakfast bars. There's a few different things. Some puddings from Rebecca and the chocolate milk. I'm just going. I'm a pedestrian. <coughs> now see your sign says, which nobody can read, as they drive by just so you know which is actually kind of good in your case because it says need money that's considered panhandling is it really? yeah you can get arrested for that i'm dead serious even though you're not verbally saying it you have it written which is the same i'm just giving you a fair warning but here you go guys thank you so much yeah that's pretty packed up <laughs> and uh well you'll see very similar to last time. No, those are some Ritz bits and some little some candies. Yeah, those are cheese. Those are cheese Ritz, and there's peanut butter Ritz in there too. But uh, yeah, yeah, they're pretty awesome. Of course, Slim Jim. Yeah. Thank you. I'm just trying to let you guys know you're new. You're new to this homeless thing. Yeah. And I've been around for a little bit, and I've seen what's happened, and it's a I mess. Got a yeah. You know about that guy getting killed over there? Yeah. 
Did somebody actually kill him? Or? Well, that yeah, it's yet to be determined. The let the la the latest update that I have is the fact that his his uh his remains, his body is in Atlanta uh, for an autopsy. Uh, with the, with their crime lab. There's not, there, there's, uh, rumor going around saying it was a murder staged as suicide. Well, you know what happens when you start listening to what other people say. Stuff goes crazy and get murdered. Yeah, so, I, I don't know if I'd worry about it so much. Uh, but to answer your question in a shorter sense is like, uh, to me it's 50-50. You know, I've seen him before, but I have not met him. But I've met a lot of people that know him, especially that day, last Father's Day. You know, but uh. Okay, who was it? His name is Mikey Mike. Was it that guy in that wheelchair? No, no, that's that's uh, Ronald. No, no, no. This guy was this. The guy you're talking about, he had died through about five days before you. You even met the guy in the wheelchair. Really? Yeah. Well, before Father's Day, it was it was the, you know, early in the week. I think it was Tuesday, of the the week of Father's Day. So like the 14th, or something like that. Somewhere in there. Wow. But, all right, guys. But uh, yeah, I don't know. There's nothing in the papers. You know, you know, nothing on the internet. You'd think that would happen first. You know, yeah, I know. For sure. But, uh, okay, there's some chocolate milks in there. You, you might want to get on those before they get a, you know, a little toasty. <laughs> we're, we're over 100 degrees. You guys are in the shade, but it's still, you know, oh, it's, still, yeah. it's still pretty darn, pretty darn warm. And, uh, you know, there's some puddings, of course, like last time. All right, I'll let you do your business, man, but I'm just going to say be careful. And always clean up your area. Yeah. When you leave, clean up your stuff. Okay, good, good. Because that's going to be the first uh, first red flag. You know, it's uh, it's kind of a mess. And you guys aren't shy about it. You're right out in the middle of the public with a, basically like you're having a picnic. You know, I mean that's what you know that's how it that's how it will look. Yeah. You know. But, uh, all right. Hey, did you get a chance to explore behind here like I was telling you about? Uh, uh, a little bit. We saw what looked like uh, an, another old homeless camp. Yeah, that's what I'm talking about. We stayed there earlier, but I was getting bit up by mosquitoes quite like a lot. Okay. You need some, uh, you need some uh, bug repellent type stuff? Please. Yeah, I got some bug stuff. All right, let me hook you up. I'll be right back. I gotta cross the road of death. Yeah. This is a mess over here. Repel. Yeah. All right. Then I'll leave them to their business. It's bad enough you gotta be out here on your own, no place to stay. And then all of a sudden, then all of a sudden, you're getting chewed up. Mosquitoes, spiders, etc. All right, here you go, guys. You. That's a good stuff. Repel. Well, alrighty then. Thank you. Yeah, I'll let you get back to it. But like I said, please be careful. We and uh, it's, uh, I'm telling you, the, the right, it's right around the corner of at least getting questioned. If you've got uh, any particular things, parking ticket, anything, it could be bad. So, all right, please be careful. Be safe. Find a good spot. You know, stay out of the heat. Yeah, that's impossible. <laughs> no, I hear you. All right, guys. I'll talk to you guys soon. If I see you again, I'll stop. Yeah. All right, have a good one. Tell the truth, guys. They've basically been dodging a bullet now for a while. I mean, because they're in quite the plain sight. So, to tell the truth, it's really just a matter of time. Sad to say, but it's just the way it is. Totally sucks. But, uh, all right, we're gonna be back. 
wow what a what a hot day this is this is hurtful all right see you in a bit